Hi, this is Dustbox Mom, and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes Chronicles. I decided against having Tarnum tackle the Pit Lords right away. I'm, I'm sure I'll get to them pretty soon, but I decided to have him have a chat with the familiars guarding the ore pit, and we were able to talk them into joining us. So now let's get into the castle. Let's see, we're going to build this turn probably the kennels. And I will try to have one of the gopher heroes. Which, in this case, means, yeah, Your Majesty, you're a gopher hero. A fairly important gopher hero, but nevertheless a gopher hero. found an unguarded hall of sins and he picked up a few extra dogs for Tarnum. Now, I want to look for basically anything gray and have Tarnum flag those things. Cuffer, get out of the way. Somebody else is in the way. Like Rion. Okay. No. Got Sonya down there. She's still picking up resources. Start adding your back up. Still have Sylvia here. And there's still some stuff she can pick up. And other imp crucible that we can recruit more imps from. Okay, that's about all she can pick up, so. Getting her back to turn. Okay. Can anybody reach the ore mine? Or maybe we get Allison out of the way, then Tarnum can finally move. Okay, yeah, Rion's still in the way, but Tarn can go around the long way. Oh, we could try defeating the demons that are guarding the Forsaken Palace. And they run. Forsaken Palace is going to be kind of tricky. That is, that is the tier 7 generator. So we save first. But certainly devils would be powerful troops. Evil, but... Powerful. Okay, so that's 480 points of damage. It's only a single stack of units, though. So. 
Magic Girl should do it. Yay. Yes, I would like to recruit devils. Okay. Now maybe head there. And I think we're ready to move on to the next turn. <gasps> okay. That is a pretty powerful garrison. I hope it takes the purple guys a while to get through. Okay. What can we build here? Demon Gate. Now, of course, at this point, Tarnum doesn't really have room for demons, at least not until we start building the upgraded versions of some of the creature dwellings. So, I'll just send him to scare off the heck hounds. closest. Okay, let's double check to see who is short. Okay, everybody's got their ammo cards. So that's not a problem. there's anything else for these other people to flag until Tarn clears the way. Probably a good idea to start... Ah, you know what we could do though. Have people get into position by some of those creature generators. since it is the end of the first game week. Do we have any creature generators off that way? It didn't look like it. Yeah. They're pretty much all over here. Okay, that should do. Astrologers proclaim Blizzard Week. Okay, we 
build a heckle this turn. And we might have Allison hang on to these troops for the moment. I think for basically just resource, I mean, mine clearing and creature generator clearing, we can do that without any extra troops for the moment. troops and flag mines and creature generators that Tarnum's just clear. Mentor, one of the few companions who accompanied me to this level, has been trying to find out where Dorm's located. Dorm's lo I've learned that he doesn't trust Duke Dizalus any more than I do, but there isn't much we can do about it. Down here, we just don't have the access to materials or men to support ourselves. We need troops if we're going to defeat Jorm. Yeah. Normally, I wouldn't bother having turn and pick up the troops himself, but it was on his way to these heck hounds. gather up these troops that other people have. Picked up as he heads south. I don't think anybody's been to the kennels yet. Yeah. Just playing leapfrog, basically, with the people running around to the creature generators and hiring troops, ferrying them from one to the other. Oh, okay, maybe she has been there. I couldn't remember, frankly. Inferno 
town. I think we'll build the fire lake. troops forward to Tarnum. run. There's a magic well which we aren't in as urgent need of. See think. Okay, there are some heck hounds down there. Alright, I think that's about everything that can be cleared. What is there up there? Oh, there's an abandoned mine. So that's what I missed. Okay. Silly. All this musical troops. Okay, I'm going to assume that Sonya was the one who hired those heck hounds at the beginning of the game week. But I don't really need to go there again. Okay, Cuthbert's not going to be able to get through there. Although I don't think I'm going to build the upgraded version. Well, actually, I might still keep Allison at the castle so she can upgrade those units. Hmm. I might even have Cuthbert start ferrying troops back to the castle instead of to Tarnum.
We need to start getting people out of Tarnum's way. Aha! There's a few spells that Cuthbert didn't quite know yet. Sonia, let's head down this way. I don't think, oh, actually Rion can get past. Probably nobody can get past Rion now, but I think we can start. Like, at least that. Since we have both imps and familiars in Tarnum's army, it would be worthwhile building that upgrade building before any of the others. And I think we'll leave her in place for now. Almost reach the abandoned mine. Okay. I think I'll work on building some of these other things rather than more upgrade structures just yet. That way it will be easier to combine the troops I hire. With the troops from the creature generators. So we'll have Tarnum finish flagging all those gray buildings on our side of the map, and then we will probably tackle those Afrites guarding that teleporter that seems to go directly into the purple area without going through the garrison in our next episode. So we will see you then.